Hello family, friends, and followers. It's Hike360 here. A little bit more lively than my last video. Who do we have? Who is this guy? This is my brother, Neil. You might Neil. have to spin the camera to see him. Neil, why don't you just come hello. in here and say hello. Hello. Oh, oh shit. Oh. <laughs> Clearly, I don't know. I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm new here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm new here. <laughs> So we're, we're hanging out at Illini State Park. Neil just came in, he drove my grandmother's car over. So uh, here we are, and it's your first time at a state park, like, hanging out with us. Yeah, I mean, I went to, um, what's the one with the statue? Loudoun State Park. Yes, I've been to Loudoun State Park, which is very fun. But I think this is, I mean, that was like years ago, so it's been okay. a while. All right, so a couple years ago, Loudoun State Park, um, if you want to check out Loudoun State Park, we have videos in the playlist section where there's also Black Hawk statue. Very cool place to be. But no, we're at Illini State Park. We're hanging out at the cabin that we, uh, we have discovered. And uh, this will be our second night, first day, second night that uh, we've been hanging out here. So we're about to have lunch. We've got our famous uh, sunflower butter and jelly sandwiches. We're actually not going with the ginger preserve jelly today. We've got strawberry banana jelly. Um, uh, is it strawberry or mango banana? No, no, no. It's strawberry banana jelly. Is it the grand conjunction? <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> it's not. So, like I said, strawberry banana jelly with the sunflower butter, really good sandwiches. And dad, what are you doing here? Well, I'm trying to get the coffee going. We're going to do some afternoon coffee here. Okay, I like that. Yeah. And uh, so I like to handle the filters here a little bit to get them water going. Anyway. Break them in? Break them in. Cool. We got some sun shining. Some astronomy tonight. What's happening tonight? Well, so uh, let me start by saying yesterday was the winter solstice, which makes it the shortest day of the year and the longest night of the year and the official start to winter. So we got to have that last night, as well as last night was the Great Conjunction. And what that is, is the view to Saturn and Jupiter. Saturn and Jupiter in the sky to last night were so close that they looked like one single uh, beam of light, one single planet. planet. And uh, that will happen again tonight. And so we're going to look out for it because by the time we were looking at it last night, it was a little too late and the planets were below the horizon. Uh, we're using the SkyMap app at the, in the Google store if you guys want to pull that out and see the sky for yourself. Sponsored. Yeah. Shout out. Shout out to Google. SkyMap. Yeah. Sponsor us. Sponsor us, SkyMap. Yeah, give us a call sometime, Google. Yeah. We'll be here. Yeah. So uh, we're going to look at that again tonight at like maybe 5 o'clock when it gets dark. Anything else going on? Anything crazy happened on your car ride over? Worth mentioning? Not really? No, I just listened to like this channel that had all the bops from like, I would say like 2015 to now. Um, and I was just jamming out. <laughs> Lovely. It was nice. I think your big surprise for this trip is going to be uh, seeing a barge. Yes, and it's, learning what a barge is. Yeah. Yeah, so to give you an idea, behind here, these four, five of them, those circular deals, those structures. huge structures, circular structures in the middle of the river, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. those are basically buoys. Like, the, they're, the barges are so big that they need that sort of thing to bounce off of them if they get into trouble. Wow. Well, yeah, yeah, that'll give you some scale. Yeah, that'll give you some scale. Oh, they're big. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they're big. I wasn't sure. Yeah, yeah. Well, you'll see tonight when the light shines. So the, they go in and out. The locks are straight down. And the way this lock comes up, the light actually shines in as if it's a car behind the cabin. Huh. It's a weird angle. It woke me up last week and I guess a little last night as well. So if you get a big bright light, it's not an alien. It's And it's the brightest light I've ever seen in my entire life. Uh, wow. Just on the top of these things. 
It's two um, million lumens. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> calculated <laughs> um so you know you'll you might get rocked out of bed a little bit by just the light and then and then the vibrations from the boat motor so every time we've slept in the cabin the uh oh the God. floodlights from the barge do pierce the window in the cabin and have woken us up even with the shades shut every night even with the shades shut the barge floodlights are insane the way you're describing this is like very scary descriptive like they're gonna pierce the windows and they're gonna yeah. shake us out of bed and like, like expecting like a monster <laughs> <laughs> i'm like worried yeah well they're they're big it's threatening just don't feed it after midnight yeah, yeah. absolutely <laughs> <laughs> that's the secret all right Great. uh in other news uh i am waiting to hear back from the illinois unemployment office <laughs> That's That was difficult to do this morning. Uh, the website was less than user friendly and the several avenues I tried to making a claim were uh, not denied but uh, collapsed. They were, they failed. So I called and they said, we'll call you back. A robot told me, I've got a place in line. So I say that because uh, the last video I mentioned that that was going on. All right. Yeah. All right. Peace.